And just where do you think you're going? Without your welcome home kiss. Hmm. Hello, Honeybun. I've missed you. Oh, you know. Just the usual things. Cleaned up the house. Took care of the livestock. Though I did have to handle a little vermin problem in the yard. <laughs> Made for a tasty lunch, if nothing else. Mm. No, no rabbits. You know you're the only rabbit I've got a taste for anymore. You're about to really distract me, darling. And while I do love when you get distracting, I want to hear about your day first. Why don't you hop along into the living room while I get us some iced tea? <laughs> That's good rabbit. Here you go, hon. Hmm? Oh, my. So it is. Dreadfully sorry, darling. You know how it can have a mind of its own sometimes. And your lap is just so very comfy a spot for it to rest in. Oh. Darling, that just ain't playing fair. You know how sensitive my rattle is. I've mind. No. No, no. You're not gonna get me that easy. You can be such a brute sometimes, I swear. Teasing a poor dame like that. Whether I like it or not doesn't change your poor manners, hon. I'm quite insulted. Really. <sighs> well, I reckon I'm not that insulted, upon further consideration. But only if I get another. <laughs> Mmm. Your lips are even sweeter than the tea, hun. But enough of that. How was your day? Well, it sounds like you've had quite the busy day. Oh, you absolute charmer. But I suppose I do make a good incentive to get through it all, don't I? And you know, I could give you even more incentive if you need it. Hmm, how about...
Extra kisses tomorrow when you get home. <laughs> oh, it's a start, is it? Someone's feeling awfully greedy today. Mm. Good thing I like it when you get greedy. Goodness, finished already. He must have been right parched, huh? Not to worry. I just made a fresh pitcher. It's in the kitchen. Hold on. Aren't you forgetting something before that? Come here. That's better. I hope you didn't think you'd get away without our daily cuddling. Mmm, yes. We do. But cuddling after you get home from work always feels special. And you always look happier after. You do. But you always do like getting spoiled, don't you, hon? Honest as always. Mmm. It is such a beautiful day, isn't it? Weather's supposed to be nice all week. The animals are gonna love it. Yes, I'll be loving it too. But I love it even more with you. What do you say, hon? Why don't we go out for a bit this weekend? Get some fresh air and sunshine. Hmm. We could always go for a walk by the lake. It's always got the most beautiful sunsets, too. Or... We could take a stroll through the fields. Maybe hunt my favorite prey while we're there. I wonder... Something cute. Tasty. And who makes the most adorable scream when I snatch them? <laughs> oh, yes, you do, hon. I've heard it plenty of times now. And I never get tired of it. Sorry, hon. We're just lost in thought. Just thinking about how happy I am. Here, with you. I'm still amazed at where we are now. A beautiful home. A lovely ranch with our own animals. You and me. Living a perfect domestic life. I would never have considered it before we met. <sighs> and I would have been perfectly happy in my field. If you hadn't slithered your way into my life. Well, thank you, darling. It took some time to get used to, I'll admit. But I don't think I could ever go back from living the home life. 
and I like to think my cooking has improved from those early days together. Ugh, yes, I remember the casserole. It took ages to clean that up. I felt so awful about it, too. Your poor kitchen. Hey, don't laugh. It wasn't funny. Oh, fine. Maybe it's a little funny looking back. Hmm. No. I think you can wait a bit longer to get up. I haven't seen you all day, after all. And that means I got a full day's worth of hair playing and cuddling to get out of my system. You don't mind that much, do you? I didn't think so. Love you too, honey bond.